tell me what is your project about? Um, yeah, in a few words, uh, it's uh, a project that divided in two. One is an exhibition space. Yes. Composed by a certain amount of objects. And then within that, ob that space, the gallery space, we have another space, mm -hmm. um, a film, which I take as a, as a space, as a diegetic space, where I um, installed, so to speak, in fact, edited 10 of the previous films um, together. So they now compose a new, in a way, uh, story. And so it's a space within a space. When you come in, you see this room, the space. Gallery. And you turn. And then, yeah, and then you, uh, and then uh, that, that uh, moment, so to speak, where the, the automaton or the gallery is animated, lasts for 30 to 35 minutes. And then, uh, and then the new space comes in, and um, that lasts for an hour and 20 minutes. And um, so you have a sort of like two momentum, so to speak, yeah. When you, and there's a moment where one don't know where we are. There's a moment when the, at the end of the film, where the room wakes up, so to speak, and, uh, and try to remember, through the use of AI, to remember sequences of the film, or to reinvent sequences of the film. And, uh, and then the film starts again. So it's a way, it's a learning process, you know, of uh, the film screen, and then how to remember it. But when, why do you want it a, a, so, a turning so far? Um, it's, some, it's, a, it's a device that I used before in uh, two shows, one at the Armory Park, I had that as well. And uh, I had it installed as well at the uh, Opus Bar in Berlin. So it's what I call quasi-objects, the objects which are uh, objects with a purpose and also an artwork. But it's a good introduction to to relax and to to feel the film after. Yes. What, what about the animals that we see after that? So the uh, animal is a um, it's a cuttlefish. It's part, it was a film that I that I uh, produced some time ago called uh, uh, Anywhen, and uh, that was shown at uh, Tate, and uh, which is a cuttlefish that I had in the studio for me and uh, so it's a film about that creatures that uh, change colors and communicate so to speak in a non-symbolic way and it's a creature that I also, also I think shown for the first time at Musée d'Art Moderne de la Ville de Paris. Already with Ancillary Chaubrist? Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, what do you think of Jean Pinlevé's work? Yeah, it's a, it's a master. It's a master. It's an inspiration in a way? Yeah, it was an inspiration, yeah, of course. Yeah. Not for that specific film, but uh, yeah, yeah. Because he worked in the 30s, right? Yeah. Merci.